Milton and his men took it a Van Horn to be put on a boat and tried for murder. I am sorry to hear that. We gotta let her go. John's a... Well, sorry, son. Without John, she's just bait. Got a bunch of money, Dutch. She's just a girl. They won't do nothing to her. But me and the boys know. Yep. We need to keep riding on this one, Dutch. You know it. Every man here knows so we it. we just gonna let the boy be made an orphan? It, it ain't like that. So what is it like? I wanna live, cowpoke. I still got the choice, Dutch. It's just a girl. You're right. Dutch, Micah. Uh, it pains me to say it, Arthur. But he's right. Dutch! Come on, boys. Yeah! Yeah! God damn years. Come on, Arthur. Let's go get her. You and me is all we need. Miss Tilly. Here. Take this. <clears throat> you take this money, too. Take Jack. You wait a copper headland for Abigail and Mrs. Adler. Thank you, Arthur. You're a good girl. You live a good life now, you hear? All right, Arthur. I'll... I'll miss... Me too, sweetheart. Jack, come here. Be brave, son. I'm gonna go get your mama. Mrs. Adler! Ride with me! Okay, so you're gonna notice that was a little strange. <clears throat> My system actually put just... Her on a boat, they'll probably die. The just cut out for so no seemingly reason. Oh, and I went and looked it up. The Litchfield repeater is based off the Henry repeating sure, rifle. I guess. No. God, those goddamn bastards. Look, just follow me, okay? We're gonna get this done, Arthur. I'm sure we are. Let's kick some ass. He don't care if he orphans his friend's child so long as he gets rich. All his goddamn talk all them years. Seems like it was always a lie. Or he went crazy. What a mess. Sure. Guess he began to believe he was God or something. I don't know. I'm sorry you got dragged into this. Into us. Listen. If you hadn't shown up in my house that night, I'd be dead. And even this bullshit beats dead. <laughs> so well said. I could find a way to get John, Abigail, and Jack out of this mess. Give them a life. Seems I left it too late. If we could still get Abigail, maybe her and Jack will be okay. John, Hosea, Mac, Davey, Jenny, Sean, Lenny, we have to put an end to this. <coughs> an eagle flies, another angry fool he used just like he did with the rest of us. Like I said, Arthur, we don't need them. We're gonna make this right, me and you together. What's left of it. Now come on. Let's get her done. I was worried I was going to have to actually play through the train job again. Thank God I didn't. <coughs> Still got a slight cough. Okay, here we are. Let's ditch the horses and come up with a plan. Mark my rifles, my rifles. How you feeling? Okay. Like shit. I think you should cover me and I'll go in there and get her. Cause you're the better shot, I mean. That ain't what you mean. I can still fight. I know, Arthur. But just do it my way, honey. It's for the best. Get up someplace high, like the lighthouse or something. And cover me. Please. 
Okay, I have my repeating shotgun, is that? Yes. Let's get to it. I'm on sniper duty. Which is okay by me. Even though I prefer to be in the thick of the action. This is why I don't really like this, because I can't... There's an anomaly in the scope or something. I know it's there because it looks good. But I can't really see what I'm supposed to be doing. Fuck, I don't even know where Sadie is. I don't know what I'm doing. Take the headset off, it's bugging me. I, I cannot fucking see. Let me be in the thick of the fight. I can not see. still. That helps highlight things a little bit. Shooting Sadie. Come on, get in there. Shit. Okay, Mr. Milton. I guess we're 
Did he get Sadie? Yeah, he got Sadie. I've got my shotgun and I've got my pistols. Keep pushing forward. God damn it. <clears throat> Everything slowed frickin' down. I couldn't react fast enough. I gotta get the shit cleaned out of my chest. I would like to. Oh, now I don't even have my. <clears throat> God damn it! I hate when it does this. It took my damn good pistol away. That pisses me off. Why does it do that? Dead man walking anyway. Don't you take another goddamn step. Will somebody shoot that bastard?
Can you bleed? Are you now? Mr. Morgan. That's quite a cough. Sure. Tuberculosis. I'll be dead soon. And you with me, Mr. Milton? You'll be dead, sure. But I'm gonna be just fine. We offered you a deal, Mr. Morgan. You should have taken it. I'm a fool, Mr. Milton. Not all you boys have quite so many scruples. Old Micah Bell. Micah? You mean Molly? Molly O'Shea? Sweated her a couple of times, never talked a word, had to let her go. Micah Bell. He, he did him sell up. me out. The boys came back from the Caribbean, and he's been a good boy ever since. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Using your strength, Mr. Morgan. You're still a yapping dog, Mr. Milton. Nice shot. <clears throat> Horrible man. Come on, both of you. Find the horses. We need to get the hell out of here. What happened to Jack? Where is he? He's fine. Tilly's got him. Oh, thank God. Abigail, you ride mine. Get on, Arthur. Get on. You'll be okay. Hey. No, I don't think I will. Where's my Mauser? It did not seriously get rid of my Mauser. better So much easier if I was the one riding here. to John. Where's John? I, I don't know. Think... 
Arthur. He... What? He got killed or he no. got captured. No. I'm really sorry. No! Abigail, I'm, I was on the train and I didn't see it. No! Listen. No. We got Jack. He's safe. Mrs. Adler will take you to him. But, John, I want you to know this. He loved you. He loved you and Jack, he did. He wasn't perfect, but he did. Now, you gotta go get that boy. Come on, get out of here. What? Arthur, what are you doing? I gotta go have a little chat before I get much sicker. No, Arthur. Don't you owe Arthur me. Neither of you two. Not <coughs> now. You both know. <coughs> You're good women, good people, best. You go get that boy. There'll be time for sorrow later. If you're headed back there, Arthur, take this. I don't need it anymore. What's that? There's a chest in the caves, in the back to the left, hidden under a wagon. Duchess chest. All our money. I know John told you I knew where it was. Abigail Roberts. I always was a good thief. That you was. <laughs> Go on, get out of here. Micah has a lot to answer for. I knew he couldn't be trusted. The many things we learn. The building of a shrine. Only just to burn. That's the way it is. That's the way it is. I just wish you'd done it before he worked himself into the grave. I'm really sorry for you, son. It's a hell of a thing. And all you can do now is decide the man you want to be for the time you have left. May the wind be at your back. Good fortune touch your head. May the cards lay out astray All from your command That's the way it is That's the way it is We already owe more than it's worth I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. Thank you, Bella. You know, there ain't enough kindness in this world, that's for sure. I would get to shoot Micah. I'd very, very much like to shoot Micah. Get them bags packed up quick, Miss Grimshaw. Come on, all of you. Well, we're doing our best. Hurry, we ain't got long. Hurry. We just got plenty of time, Micah. Oh. 
We all need to have a little chat. Blacklong, you're back. Hooray. <coughs> I just saw Agent Milton, Dutch. Abigail shot him. She's okay. Not that you care too much about that. You rats. All of you. Seems old Mark, it was pretty close with Milton. What the hell are you talking about, Capo? You talked. That's a goddamn lie. Dutch. Dutch. Think of the future. Milton told me. And you believe him, Black Lung? You believe him? It all makes sense now. No. It damn well doesn't. Dutch. Think. Dutch. Be practical now. Dutch! John? You left me. You left me to die. My boy. I didn't have a choice. John, I didn't... You! I didn't have a choice. You left me! All of you? You pick your side now because this is over. All oh, them years, Dutch, for this snake. <laughs> oh, be quiet, cowpoke. Be quiet. You live in the clouds. No, you be quiet, Mr. Bell, and put down your gun. There's Pinkerton's coming fast. <laughs> Molly. No. no. No, I wasn't Molly. That was Grimshaw. Molly's My dead. Mom's too. <laughs> Is with me. And who is betraying me? Well, I'm here. Think. Think for yourself. He's lying. He's lying. Put your guns down! God damn it! Move! You ready, John? Yeah. Well, I got the bolt action. That that'll have to do. Everyone get down. This is Angel Rock with the Pinkerton Detective Agency. Put your down. Now. We gotta go. Come on. Oh, I do have the Litchfield repeater. Good. I am following you. Those bastards left me for dead. Seems that's what they do now. I see them over here. Come on, Arthur, with me. And they're just up ahead. Michael was the rat, John. Milton told me. <coughs> we should have killed him months ago. Let's keep moving. You should have killed Milton when they showed up at the camp near Rhodes. <laughs> Okay. That's what you think is best.
Abigail. Abigail's safe. So's Jack. Where are they? It was Sadie. The Copperhead landed. Thank you, brother. I want you to not look back. Like I said. Get gone. I figured he ran. Where is my Mauser? It seriously took my Mauser away. Oh, that pisses me off more than it really should. Pinkerton's coming through the trees. Watch out. That, that pisses me off. Where are you going? Well, yeah, they're Pinkertons. They've got the government's backing. Yeah, we really should. I'm coming! Oh, and I took away my rifles. Great. Come on, brother. Let's go. Give me a sec. Come on. Push, Arthur. Thank you. Arthur! Come on, Arthur. Yeah. Let's go. This is our final stand. Money. Abigail gave me the key. I head down there, I'm dead in five minutes. I got a family. That's more important. Ah, uh, maybe you're right, but... Uh, you want the money? You head down. I gotta go to my family. Fuck it. I'm coming with you. I'm gonna get you out of this bullshit. It's the last goddamn thing I do. Thank you. Ah, oh, shit. Let's go. We need to find out. Fair ground. Don't worry about them. They'll just be going back for the money. We need to get the hell out of here. But who actually was the rat during the bank job? The the reason we bailed to the Caribbean was because the bank job went south. God damn it! God damn it! They're everywhere! Get out! Let's go! Come on! Come on! We need to get going! We need to get out of here! Let's go! Lead the way!
right, Arthur, come on, let's go. You go. Keep pushing, Arthur. No. <coughs> no. I think I've pushed all I can. Come on. You go. We ain't got time for this. Not now. We ain't both gonna make it. Go. Now. I'll hold them off. It would mean a lot to me. Please. There ain't no more time for talk. Go. Arthur. Go to your family. Arthur! Get the hell out of here and be a goddamn man. You're my brother. Really is the final stand. Let's go out and fight. Micah. I got you now, Black Lung. You rat! You rat! I'm a survivor, Black Lung! A survivor! That's all there is! Living and dying! They're both gonna die here. But I'm gonna put this son of a bitch in the dirt. your knife, but, man. Can I please just go for my knife? Marston, if you want to come here and bail me out, that'd be great. Black Lung! 
You ain't gonna reach that gun. You sure about that? You ain't. You lost my sick friend. You lost. Man. Despite my best efforts to the country, it turns out I won. It is over. Now. What? Dutch. It's over. Oh, Dutch. He's right. You know it, and I know it. He's sick. He's dying. He's talking crazy. Come on, Dutch. Let's go, buddy. We made it. We won. Come on. John made it. He's the only one. The rest of us. No. But I tried. In the end, I did. Come on. Let's go. We can make it. He's dying. Come on, Dutch. Come on. I really would have liked to kill Micah. I would have loved to have killed Micah. Good. That was great, even. Some years later. That was close. Redemption. Too close. We brought that trouble on ourselves. By we, you mean me. The one me who went and shot him. Seemed like he deserved shooting. I'm sure he did. But I've been thinking, ain't it about time you stop being the man making them decisions? I'm trying. Are you? I think so. 
I gotta find some place to lay low. Keep quiet. <sighs> Maybe Dutch was right. Maybe we should have just gone to Tahiti. Is that it with you? Tahiti or killing? Come on, John. Please try. Try what? We gotta live somewhere for more than just a few weeks. Okay. Let's see what we can find in, in Strawberry. What do you know about Strawberry? I know they like good, honest, hard-working men a whole lot more than angry killers. So make yourself good and honest. I am always honest. Maybe not always good, but I'm always honest. My whole life I've been surrounded by fools with moral codes. Here's the moral code. Look out for folks. Stop trying to act like some hero in a book. What do you know about heroes in books? My reading's getting pretty good. We'll read different books then. The books is Jack's. And, well, maybe he's doing most of the reading, but still. You're a bad influence on your mother, boy. <laughs> boy? I'm sorry, sir. What was that? I said you're a bad influence on your mother. With your books. Which books was that? You know, that dime novel and Boy Calloway and the Men from the Moon or whatever it was. I'll do my best to find better reading material, Pop. Is that what you like, then? Western tales? They're good Boy. books. What's good stories. Like? Do you enjoy tales of the Wild West? Not so much. Anymore. I've been reading about knights. You know, of the round table. The king. What's his name? There's King Arthur. And there's Sir Lancelot. And the Lady Guinevere. And a whole lot of others. Those names. I kind of like them. You know what? So do I. Yeah, this is going to be where the story goes from here. It's me. I guess a little epilogue, prologue kind of thing. It's an epilogue to this game, a prologue to the first game. I bet that sign says strawberry, don't it? I got a yep. good feeling about this place. Been a long time. Why don't you pull up just here? I'm gonna go see what kind of good, honest work I can find. Grave digging or polishing some rich fella's boots or some such. Me too. See if me and the boy can find some laundry work or something. Help you, son? I'm hoping I can help you. I saw the help wanted sign outside. Sure, but uh, you're a bit old to be stacking groceries and running errands, ain't you, son? Well, uh, I ain't too proud to do nothing. As long as it's honest and it pays. <laughs> Time's hard, Mr. Uh, Milton. Jim Milton. Yeah, my wife and I and our boy. We was robbed mm. a few days ago. Lucky to get out with our lives, we was. Now, uh, well, we need money. Yeah, there's bad folk out there. Yeah, <laughs> tell me about Not it. a wagon by any chance? Sure. Well, then maybe you could run some goods up to Pronghorn Ranch for me. You know, uh, head west past Owen Gila, then follow the road north, lead you right there. I, I don't know where that is, but I'm sure I can find it. I can leave right now if it, you'd like. It's Getty's place. Fine fella. Uh, where's the wagon? It's just outside. Um, you know, I should go tell my wife, and then I can come back and get loaded. No, my boys can load you up while you go find your wife. Okay. No weapons. I don't like that. I'm going to end this one here. Thank you all for watching. Join me next time on Red Dead Redemption 2 as I continue with this... I'm not even sure what to call it, and we'll see where we go from there. But until then, I am the Dark Seraph, signing off.